Welcome back to the channel, you guys. How is everybody doing? Good. Because we're back with an amazing video, you guys. Your girl is going to cook some meatless, plant-based burgers. If you're ready for these smoky, spicy burgers, you guys, come on in. So guys, what we have today is some plant-based burgers. Now, I have tried meatless uh, burgers before, but I purchased them. But And I purchased this as well, don't get me wrong. But we're going to cook it ourselves today, you guys. And we bought this burger box from Whole Foods Market over in Detroit. Now, yes, your girl wanted to try it, you know. Um, something different. My daughter found these, and these are four ounces patties. Uh, well, two ounces patties, four patties, you guys. So, yes, I want to give it a try and see what happens because I want to eat vegan today. And what we're going to have with it is some boiled rice. Now, I'm not going to make these into a burger burger, but we're going to go ahead and we're going to do us uh, some burgers with a little rice. And maybe smother them in some gravy. Who knows? But, anywho, stay tuned. And, yeah, get comfortable because that's what we're doing on this channel today. We're going to go on in here and we're going to put these already on. This preheated grill. Okay? So, as you see, I got four patties. And this is what it's looking like. Okay, let me get this and open this up for you guys. I'm going to give you a close-up on the last one. Well, that's not the last one. Let me take that back. <laughs> this is the last one. So, Oh, my goodness, I'm almost about to drop it. So, anywho, this is what it looks like, you guys, because it's meatless. And yeah, I'm curious on how it's going to actually taste, okay? So yeah, we're going to let them cook. And then, I got my rice over here. Because I want to go ahead and let that get reheated. Because I'm using the success rice. Because I want to trick up the system, okay? Like I say, you guys, I'm experimenting. I'm so used to eating our soul food and you know different things and I'm trying to avoid from continuing that same pattern you kind of get me so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna reach over here and I'm gonna give me a little black pepper that's how we're gonna start this off because it said it's spicy so we're gonna see how spicy this burger really is so we're gonna put us a little black pepper on here only on one side we're not going to heavily coat it. And I'm just going to take a my spice mix. Well, you know, my season mix. I'm just going to lightly season this. And I'm going to let this go on and do its thing. Now, we got seasoning all up in the skillet. So, when we, when we flip it, the season going to catch it, okay? We're not going to use any oil in this because... The gravy itself is going to be made with a little olive oil because I know olive oil is a little healthier for you. But meantime, we're going to go and let this water boil for this rice and we'll see you in a minute. As you guys can see, I have touched this, flipped it. And so what I noticed is it has a dryness on it. And so what your girl is going to do is take a little canola oil. And I'm just going to spray, just like so. Because I don't too much like that dryness going on. I know I am going to submerge it. Okay? And that's some delicious gravy that we're going to use. 
So yeah, let me go ahead and take out me a bag of this rice since we got our water boiling. I'm not going to put any margarine into this water, but I only need enough rice for me and Carter for who all, all the people that know who he is. So yeah, this is his little lunch. Uh oh. I done met at the top, y'all. But we gonna keep it just like that. Keep it up. Yeah, so we'll be back. Okay, guys, so I have some olive oil, extra virgin, sunflower. And we're just going to use just a little. Why? Because we're going to make just a little gravy. But what I am going to do is I'm sauteing me some onions. We're going to get that all around in here just like so. And we're going to submerge just a, one small onion, finely chopped or chopped to your liking. And I'm just going to go in here and let that sweat a little bit. Now, at this point, you can't add salt if that's what you prefer, you know, but your girl, she's not going to add salt. But what I am going to add is my seasoning, my special blend seasoning, because we're going to give the onions a little flavor. We're going to give the onions a little flavor. We're just going to go on here and let these sweat and do their thing. Now, this is a tip to how you make your own homemade gravy, you guys. I slid that back and I forgot to turn that back on. But anywho, those burgers... Is gonna finish cooking because yeah, we're gonna submerge these around us some gravy. Just checking on my rice. Okay, so we didn't got these cooking. I like the brownness on it. I am loving the brownness on it. Now my next move is I'm gonna put me. I'm using all-purpose flour. Now I do know they have vegan flour. Now I do not have that, but a tablespoon. I'm starting off with. Cause like I said, I just want maybe a tablespoon and a half. A little flour, that's it. We're going to go on and let that brown. And let this flour cook. Just gonna let it cook and do a thing. You cannot really take your eye off of it. I have me a cup of water right there. I'm just gonna Season up this flour right quick. Now the darker the flour is, the thinner your gravy will become. 
And most people use um, cornstarch, I believe. Let's see. We're going to go on here and we're going to put that on in here. Because I'm seeking for a lighter gravy. And instantly, as you see, it's getting thicker. Because I want to see my onions. And we're going to put some more water. So we put up some more water. Okay, our burgers are back there. Now, I am going to take my burgers out. And we're going to submerge them right on in here. I'm going to submerge them just like so. Uh oh, in here. I'm gonna put this pan in my dish water. Put this in my dish water. And we're just gonna go on and let this cook and get the goodness all over them. Because if, if I was wondering, could I smother them? Could I actually smother them? And like I said, we're gonna hit it one more time with our spices. Use whatever seasoning that you like. And we're gonna put us a lid over this. Turn it down low. Gonna turn it down low. and then go out lid and we'll be back you guys we are done and take a look at this gravy you guys and here go our smothered patties so yes the meatless patties smell delicious now like I say when it comes to the gravy you always use your vegan gravy but it's just a simple idea of what to cook and yeah, we're going to plate this up right quick. So we're going to plate this up right quick. Now over here, I have some cheese, broccoli, rice, you know. Now, of course, it's not vegan cheese. But I wanted to make sure that Carter eats his food. Oh, look at there. Now, that looks delicious. And, yeah. That is it. You guys, check out that. Do you need a close-up, you guys? Let me bring it closer. Check out that. Now, that is so tempting to eat. You guys, let's go in because I need to taste and see how spicy these vegan burgers are. Right? Because they're spicy. Spicy uh, vegan burgers. And then study making a burger, your girl made it to a smothered burger. And we're going to go in for the bite. You guys taste it first. How was it? It's delicious. Let me taste. Mmm. Okay. You get that smokiness. Oh my goodness. That is so delicious, you guys. If you haven't tried vegan uh, meatless patties, please do so. And tell me how you like it. When I tell you this makes a delicious meal, lunch meal, dinner meal, you know, maybe a go-to snack for some people. You will enjoy this. This is definitely a cheap, um, 
inexpensive meal. Mm, mm, mm. That's my plate. But anywho, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this video enough to like, comment, and share. And come join your girl if you don't mind. You know, smash that um, subscribe button to a turn gray. So you can get a notification whenever I load up a good video, you guys. And most of all, thumbs this video straight up to let YouTube know that you enjoyed my channel. But anywho, you got it. Thank you for all my thank you for all my new subscribers. Thank you for all my riders. I appreciate you and I will see you on Sunday video. Goodbye.